go as slow as shadow on the mic I play to win, never to lose In the contest of champions I'm the one that shoes Swipe straight down, my moves are slick Dexterity more heavily, I dodge quick Class champ, I'm the master of the game Cosmic science, skill tech mutant I claim Arena and chill grind, that's how I roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol The fight, I'm swift, my tactics excite Lost shadows in the arena, ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, my skills are renowned in the world of Marvel, I'm the King Crown. So listen up, here's the story of the champ, Lord Shadow's the name. I'm the Grind Track fan. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So we've got Valkyrie and Professor X in the arena, and we're going to take a look at the leaderboards and give some shout outs to those we recognize. Now, as you can see, I'm on Win Streak 5, and I've got one hour and 42 minutes yes i kept this all the way late but i'll get her done probably right after this video we got to get it done now one nice thing uh tomorrow they're gonna have a big change and i'll talk about that uh while we look at these uh leaderboards here Let's uh, go to Professor X first. He is in the basic. John Prophet, Get a Robo, and Bruce Willis occupy the first three spots. Congratulations. So tomorrow, Kabam is going to be replacing a oh, Ghetto J. Congratulations. They're going to be replacing multiple events you know we have the seven hour event we've got the 22 hour event we've got the four hour crystal all that stuff they're going to be replacing that with one daily event i am actually excited about that uh the iron joker we usually see him the reason that i'm excited about it is that it's going to change more than I think um, people are realizing. There are a lot of things that, for example, myself, uh, the way that I schedule some of the content, uh, let's just take the uh, event quest, for example. Uh, healthy and happy, congratulations. The event quest comes around, and I'm not going to want to do the event quest um you know, exploration or anything until the event quest completion event comes around. But then once I get that done, I'm done, right? But the event quest comes back around and I got to go do more event quest if I want to get those units from that um, event, which of course, as a free to play, I do. But with the change, you're going to be able to get points in pretty much everything you do because it wraps all of those quests. So that means uh, all of those events. So that means that whenever I feel like it, I can level up a champion. Whenever I feel like it, I can do the event quest. So it gives me a lot more freedom. And yes, I could have done that before, but because those units are in those events, if I want those units, I had to do that. So if I chose not to, that would be like choosing not to get units that are available. And that would just hurt my uh, progression. But now, what that means is that, you know, if I feel like doing uh, the event quest one day, then we're going to do the event quest. You know, another day, you know, if I'm doing something and there's no level up on, who cares? If I need a champ, let me just level them up, get my points for that day. I am very much looking forward uh, to this change. It is a big, big change. And I think it's going to result actually in a more consistent reward 
uh, payout. For example, that four hour uh, crystal, I don't know about you, but I'm not grabbing that every four hours. I got to sleep. And so I'm not on the game 24 seven. So there's no way I get all of the four hour crystals. But with this, I can. So that is going to be uh, tomorrow. And don't be surprised if there are bugs. Yes, bugs. All right, my girl Valkyrie. Speaking of bugs, we had the new season of Battlegrounds drop. So Kabam got a win, in my opinion, with the daily event. I love what they're doing with that. But then we have the Battlegrounds. Hold on. We got Tesla, Master Lee, and CPC Boy Boy in the first three spots. There we go. Sha Sha Boom. Timomatic. Recognize all y'all names. Little chillin'. There's Bruce Willis double dipping. Um, but I'm sure everyone that does Battlegrounds is aware of the issue. Uh, we started much lower than we should have. Combine that with the fact that they've added more tiers. However, they've also made it so that you get two medals for winning and one medal for losing. Now. Adding the tiers and all that good stuff, I don't know how that's going to feel, but I like the fact that I gain more than I lose. That just, you know, seems great to me. Iron Joker, I see you. You know, so my wins feel more rewarding and the losses less punishing. Now, they also added some good rewards in there. And I'm like, okay, okay. Um, at least that uh, gives people a little bit of um, solve, I would say. So I don't like that I have to play it more. However... Um, so far it hasn't been too bad, but I have a decent roster. I feel really sorry for some rosters. I, I, I got matched up with one guy and he pretty much had five stars. That's what he had in his roster. And I'm just like, I'm so sorry, man. I mean, what could I do? Uh, I can't even gain cause they also gave us a uh, compensation. And out of that compensation, you know, they gave us elders marks, but they also gave us victory shields. I like that more than anything else. I can't claim it because I am about 400 elders marks away from the uh, max. Let me see. Yeah. Wow. I am now 200. <laughs> away from the max the max is nine thousand. so i gotta get going and use these things so that i can claim that uh reward without you know losing my elders uh marks but but though congratulations man so i don't do any fights on energy as you can see i got plenty of elders marks and that's what I use for every fight. Win, lose, don't care. I'm going to be getting um, some points, you know. Um, but those victory shields, I think, are going to come in really, really handy when I get nearer to certain milestones, like when I'm about to get to the gladiator circuit. And the reason that we want to get to the gladiator circuit is the uh, deathless piece for vision so at the same time that we have a piece in gladiator circuit they moved us further away from 
the gladiator circuit. However, with the easier progression, um, it's not that bad. It's just a grind more than anything. And Trasis, woo! Congratulations, man. All right. So that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button. If you enjoyed the video, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll. No stress, no drama, just on patrol. In the fight, he swift. His tactics be tight. Those shadows in the arena ready to ignite. From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned. In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown. Oh, oh.